We usually just rescue flying foxes, but every now and again we get called to do a microbat rescue and we've just <clears throat> picked this little girl up. I initially thought she was a girl's wattled, but I've checked the book and she's a chocolate wattled bat. Oops! Um, I've been over and she doesn't appear to have any injuries, but she does have some bat flies on her, which I thought you might be able to see, but I think they're all in hiding. And they're really, oh there's one there. They're really interesting. There are two different species of bat fly, and the one that this one's carrying are um, Streblidae. And they're a little orange parasitic bat. Oh, there's one there, look. See that one, Mr. Batzilla? Oh, there's two. <laughs> um, yeah, there they go. And they're really interesting because they, they have little wings and they can fly, so. And the bat flies have their own parasite and they carry little mites, so it's a real um, little circle of life going on in these little bats. Terribly important to the environment. Eat lots of pest insects like um, mosquitoes and beetles and things like that. So hopefully a few days in care and this little person can um, you know, get a catch those bat flies, can go back to the wild.